and welcome to Ceiling Plays Goodbye Doggy. Judging by the title of this game, I'm assuming it's going to be sad, which I'm kind of not looking forward to. But anyway, let's start. An undying sense of loyalty has pulled your spirit. I did not finish reading that, but okay. This is interesting. So we can just go through walls. Past the quiet sobbing, you can hear their stomach madly grumbling. Okay, so we need food. This person's much too dehydrated from crying in order to continue baking. Oh. Intense barking. <laughs> I don't know who needs this. Do you need it? The person threw their duster onto the bed. They've completely given up on chores today. The sad baker notices the water bottle and hydrates properly. The newfound energy allows him to finish baking a beautiful loaf of whole grain bread. Nice! A warm fireplace stings your little snack. Ow! Oh, okay, you're... Well, someone's hungry. I think it was you. They accept the bread, never questioning its previous whereabouts. Scarfing the slice down, you can see them calm down a bit more. Anyway, you're, what do we have to do for you? Cleaning the attic for them will help. Oh! Okay, so we need the duster. The attic is totally cleaned and you found your old ball. Aw! Can I take the ball? Ah. Uh, can I take the ball? I gotta put the feather duster down. They clutch an empty stomach to a one year old to face the fact that the family downstairs I was not done reading. They're meekly chewing on the warm piece of bread, actively trying to ignore the dirty dishes in the sink. Aww. Oh, that's interesting. I just gotta spam press Z. Though the taste means nothing in your goat's leaf tongue or licking the dishes reminds you of the delicious food. The plain bread proves to be undeservedly soft for them if you could toast it. Oh, we gotta go to the fireplace. There we go. Famous hands grab the toast and its savory scent wafting through the bedroom air for the moment. Anyway, can I grab my ball? Yay! I guess I'll put it on my grave. Doggy, best furry friend forever. Oh. Can I put the ball down? I guess I put it down anyway. What do you want? Free from chores, they've picked up the crosser to relax. However, its difficulty only gives them more anxiety. They look longingly at the unfurnished homework on their desk. A myriad of complex issues. I'm slow at reading, sorry. Ah, uh, do I just click Z? Though the sheer willpower, the homework has been flawlessly completed. What? I thought I had to solve it, not just do whatever. Anyway, slightly mystified, they accept the completed homework without question. Staring at the wardrobe, a worried look crosses their face. They may need help choosing something. Um, obviously, uh, I don't know if you're a male or a female. I guess this will do. They accept your skillfully coordinated outfit as sheer look. Not only do they look cute. Ah, Didn't finish reading, but that's okay. Now, we need a pencil for them. Oh, I don't know this. The crossword answer strikes them like an empathy. Each letter's stark reminder of death. What? What the fuck? Watery eyes tell the story of the person filled with regret. Perhaps a reminder of better times would help. Uh, would my ball do? They hold the ball tenderly. Memories of warm summer days softening their expression. The tears still flow, but for different reasons. Aww. Some are an emotional yet understanding that they're taking some time to just think. While you can see the grief of your family, you know deep down that they'll be okay. You're free from your burden, you can now ascend your, to your final resting place. Go up. Oh. Oh my. 
Oh, uh, what do I do here? Just go left and right? Game by Picogram. Oh, that was nice. Really short, but nice. Dedicated to the creator's grandparents and dog. Aw, thank you for playing. Well, anyways, guys, that was Goodbye Doggy. A nice but also sad game. The only thing I didn't really like was the music was a little loud. I don't know if it's just because my volume's at a loud point. But the game was really simple and nice. But yeah, anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. And I guess I will see you all next time in whatever I make next. Goodbye for now.